Today's problem is 83 times 20. Another way we can do this problem is the distributive property of multiplication. Okay, for the first step of the distributive property of multiplication, you have to get the 83 and break it down into 80. So then you will have 80 times 20. Then you have to take the 3 from 83 and times the 3 by 20. Okay, first we need to do 80 times 20. 8 times 2 is 16. Now we just have to add two zeros because there was a zero in the 80 and a zero in the 20. Now we must do 3 times 2. 3 times 2 equals 6. Now we have to add a zero from the 20. So now our answer is 60. Okay, now since we've got our answers to 80 times 20 and 30 times, um, uh, I meant 3 times 20 equals 60, we must add the two together. Okay, all we have to do now is add 1,660. Okay, so that was very easy, the first part. Zero plus zero equals zero. Once again, that was easy, because there's only zero plus six. Adding this whole question is quite easy. So now six, and there's nothing here, so it's kind of a zero. So that's six. All we have to do is add the one. Okay. Now that we've added the one and added up the whole number, we know that our answer is 1,660. Okay, this time the method we are going to be using is drawing a picture. We're going to need to draw 20 boxes. Okay, so far I've done 10 boxes. Now we only have to draw 10 more. Okay, now that we have all of our boxes drawn, we have to write 83 in every single box. Okay, now that we've added 83 in all 20 boxes, that shows that it's multiplication. Okay, so the answer of 83 times 20 is K. But the actual answer is 1,660. A way you could do this is you could just add 83 20 times. Thanks for watching. Bye!